Hello, my name is Dr. Brett Wade. Welcome to this meditation of self-inquiry known as Atma Vichara, the meditation of self-inquiry. This meditation is the core of Yana Yoga, which is considered to be one of the highest forms of yoga, as it most directly leads to Samadhi, or connection with the divine. In this meditation, we'll be attempting to discover the true nature of self by asking ourselves, Who am I? Throughout this meditation, I will guide you back to that question, Who am I? Before beginning the meditation, I would encourage you to begin by taking a seat in the upright position. This could be in a chair or on the floor on a cushion. Close your eyes if that feels comfortable for you. If you prefer, you could have your eyes half-lidded with a downward-focused gaze. Let's begin by focusing on our breathing. Let's use yoga breath or dirga breath. This is a three-part breath, sensing the movements of breath at the belly, the chest, and the upper ribs. You may find it helpful to place a hand at each of these three areas as you inhale. Placing a hand at the belly, inhaling, Notice the movement of the belly outwards. And as you exhale, it gently comes back in. You could keep one hand on the belly and move another hand to the chest, just about the level of the sternum or heart. Inhale, notice the belly, then the chest. Now as you Inhale, we're going to move to the third part of that breath. You can keep one hand on the chest and move another hand just to the area of your collarbones. As you inhale, notice the movement of the belly, the chest, and lastly, filling right up to the collarbones. As you exhale, just follow that breath in reverse, exhaling down through the collarbones, through the chest, and lastly, letting that belly come back in. Inhaling belly, chest, collarbones, and exhaling in reverse. Just continue this breath on your own for another minute. Now, we're going to begin the meditation of self-inquiry, or Atma Vichara. I'd like you to bring to your mind the question, Who am I? Periodically, through this meditation, you can use Who am I? as a mantra. Continue to bring this question of Who am I? over and over into your mind for the next several minutes. As you bring this question of who am I into your mind, I'm going to be reminding you of some other statements which relate to this question. Who am I? The true you is unaffected by your external environment. Who am I? I 
I am not what I sense through my five senses. Who am I? I am not my thoughts and I am not my feelings. Who am I? I am not my ego or social mask. Who am I? I am pure self with no objectivity. Thoughts pass through me, coming and going like clouds in the sky. But who am I? Who am I? Who am I? I am unaffected by the external environment. I am not what I sense through my five senses. I am not my thoughts or feelings. I am not my ego or social mask. I am pure self with no objectivity. I allow thoughts to come and go like clouds in the sky. Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Gently bring yourself back to this time and this space, wiggling your fingers and toes, and just gently opening up your eyes. Well, you may not immediately have an answer to the question of who am I? In fact, it takes many years or perhaps even lifetimes of practice to come, come up with the answer to this question. But it's the practice that's important. The inquiry is what's important. The insights gleaned in this meditation may be the most important thing that you can ever learn. I'd encourage you to come back to this meditation many times. Peacefully. Brett.